rock, paper, scissors. Ah, oh, wait, why am I laughing? Let me go in <laughs> Going in for a swim. And. Whoa. Ah! Princess Toy Review. Hi, Prince and Princesses, it's Princess T. Hi, Prince and Princess, Princess Bam. Today we have another science experiment to share with you guys. Yep, we're gonna be melting styrofoam with Ooh. acetone. Check out everything we need for our experiment. First, I have some markers, and I'm also going to need some scissors, some tape, a bowl, some styrofoam cups, we need some nail polish removers. Since we're using this, make sure you ask a parent for help or permission when you're doing this experiment. And we also have construction paper. So we're gonna have to design our styrofoam cup and do whatever we want. I could draw Princess Fam on here, Princess T on here, a pineapple. Mm -hmm. Hmm, what are you gonna draw? I think I'm gonna draw, oh, I'm gonna draw a bunny. Ooh, and I'm gonna draw a marshmallow on mine. A marshmallow? A marshmallow. You'll see. All right, I'm going to grab one cup, and I'm going to grab another cup. And then we're going to get some markers. Mm. And we're going to draw and put some designs on our cute cup. So, oh, I need some working space. Okay, so I'm going to put some eyes on my little fan right here. So we're just going to do that. That's one eye. And then one more eye right over here. I'm going to cut out some bunny ears. You. I have one ear and I have a second one back here. I got me eyes and now I'm going to take this pink to make a mouth and we're just going to draw a cute little mouth right here and like so and color in the mouth. And next, I'm gonna do the same thing, but in pink, and I'm gonna make it a little bit smaller. So, I'm just going to cut, cut, cut. Hello, friend. Oh, hello. Oh, that looks very cute. I'm gonna add some chocolate on my marshmallow. So, I'm going to cut a small piece out. Actually, I'm gonna get a little bit more, and Make sure this is good. Alrighty, and then now I'm going to cut some swirls. So we're just gonna go up and down and bring it back up. All right, what do you think? I got my two bunny ears and all you do is tape them on. So I got my little drizzle here. I'm gonna cut some more. And I'm actually gonna, I think I'm gonna make a hard headband because it's almost Valentine's Day. Yeah, that's perfect. Got my little chocolate drizzle. I'm going to get two pieces of tape and I'm gonna put tape one on this side. And let's measure on our cup. All right, right there, we're gonna make sure we're not blocking any eyeballs. So right there is perfect. So I'm just gonna tape it right here, and I'll tape the other side. Okay, I have my hearts all cut out, and I put a little bit of tape on the back, and now I'm just going to add it to the top. One heart, and two hearts, and three hearts. <gasps> that's super cute! Oh, whoa, that's super cute. I love, wait a minute. I'm missing a face on mine. Mm -hmm. Okay, I better add it now. Let's see. I'm gonna get a marker here. And since you did round eyes, I guess I could do some eyes with the lashes. I'm going to kind of make like a upside down U. One here and one over here. And then we're gonna give it some lashes. <gasps> Cuteness! I need some lashes. Actually, I need to give my little bunny a cute little nose. <laughs> like this. And then, 
once I have the nose in. Then we gotta go back to our black. And now we're gonna draw on the bottom part. All done. What do you guys think? Which one do you like better? Or you can like both if you like. Now that our cute cup is done, let's go ahead and pour the nail polish from River in. Remember to ask a parent for help with this part. So we're gonna pour some here. And we're gonna pour some here. Who's gonna go in first for a swim? <laughs> I don't know, I worked so hard on it, it's so cute. Rock, paper, scissors. Okay, okay. Right. And rock, paper, scissors. <laughs> oh wait, why am I laughing? That means I gotta go first. <laughs> bye bye, Mr. Marshmallow. Okay, going in for a swim. And whoa. Science experiment again. All you gotta do is put it in the acetone or nail polish. And Whoa! Look, I'm melting! Ah! It happens super fast. And check out all those bubbles. This is all that's left of our friends. Okay, friends, that's the end of today's science experiment. If you would like more fun science experiments, give it a big thumbs up and subscribe. Bye, Prince and Princesses! Bye! Bye. Princess Toy Review. Hi, Prince and Princesses! It's Princess Team! Hi, Princess and Princess, Princess Fam. Today we're back with another science experiment. Yep, we're gonna be making our own filter and filtering out Ooh, this muddy water. Ooh, this is gross. Yeah, I got it from outside. Like outside, outside? Yep, outside. It was for free. <laughs> Let's check out what else we need for our science experiment. So, here I have some paper towels. I got some coffee filters. I also got a hand towel. I got some rocks. Ooh. I got some kinetic sand in different colors. We also have some, what is this thing called again? They're Coke bottles. Oh yeah, Coke bottles. Mm -hmm. And then we also have some rubber bands mm -hmm. and some aquarium gravel. And we need some scissors to help us open some stuff. But if you're gonna be using scissors or do this experiment, make sure you ask the parent for help and permission. Okay, so we're doing this science experiment to try to figure out which one filters the water the best. Will it be our paper towels, or will it be our coffee filters, or our mm. hand towels? What do you guys think? I'm mm. thinking coffee filter. I mean, coffee filter I mean, has a name in it. It's filter. I was gonna say the answer too. Well, we're on the same wavelength. But maybe I'll change it to this because it's thicker. Yeah. Well, I guess we better do the science experiment to see. So this is the part that you're gonna have to ask your parents for help with. So I'm gonna start with this empty soda bottle and I'm gonna get these scissors and I'm going to cut around, around, around. All right, we're all done and it's just like this and then you just place it into the bottom part like so. Oh, but wait a minute, I almost forgot. We need to add our filters. Oh, yes. Okay, okay, so these are our three. So I got our coffee filter here. We're gonna do one filter on each one. So here we have our coffee filter. I guess on this one, I'm just gonna put it in like this. What do you think, Princess Fam? Oh, well, I was thinking about maybe just putting it right here oh. on the bottom. Then that way we can put all of our other things inside here. You're right. I think that so we'll do that. Out. And then we'll tie it with a rubber band? Yep. Okay, so I'm just gonna tie mine here. 
And here is a rubber band for you. Oh, mine's like ginormous. So just make sure you tight. And then here, just make sure there is a close, flat surface. Okay, I had to cut the towel down a little bit. And then I got the rubber band on. And I'm gonna flip this over like that. Oh, and we need to do this one too. So on that one, I'm gonna get a paper towel. And then I'm going to, whoa, whoa. Okay, could you help me please? Yes. I got the rubber band, and we're just gonna tie that. Okay, and so now we have three different filters right here. Now that that's all done, what's next, Princess Fam? Well, next we're gonna make our filter. How do we do that? Well, we're gonna either add our kinetic sand, our gravel, or our rocks. Well, what do you think we should add first? Mm. The biggest or the smallest? So I'm thinking, if we want this to work, this is my hypothesis, we should go from big to small. I think that's a good hypothesis. So, we gotta go with our kinetic sand. So here I have pink, and there's also blue. We also have green and purple. Hmm. You guys know I'm gonna pick blue for this one right here. What are you gonna pick, Princess Fam? I'm gonna choose purple. Okay, so let's open up our kinetic sand. Awesome! Okay, so I'm gonna take out my kinetic sand, and before I actually put in my filter, I think I'm just gonna play with it a little bit. I mean, look at this. It feels so soft and, ooh, I think this is gonna work really, really well. Look how fine it is, okay. So I'm gonna go ahead and put it into my filter. And I'm going to get the rest of my kinetic sand. Look at my blue one. Check it out. I love it when you squeeze it together and whoa, how vibrant. Okay, I'm gonna put mine in here. And squish it down, make sure we got a whole bunch. And I'm gonna take the rest out too. Okay, I'm gonna pack up my kinetic sand really good because I think that's gonna help filter Me my too. water. Ooh. Okay. Okay. We're all good now. Okay. okay. So next, which one is bigger? The aquarium gravel or these rock rocks or gems? Hmm. Aquarium gravel. Look at this pretty aquarium gravel. Okay, I'm gonna add some here. Hmm. And while you're doing that, I'm gonna add kinetic sand to our middle one. Oh my goodness. Look how pretty this pink one is. It is super bright. I'm loving, loving the colors here too. And now it's my turn. I'm gonna put some gravel into my purple one. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Hey, these kind of look like nerds. But <laughs> don't eat not them. edible. Just pour all in there, Princess Keith. All of it? All of it. But it'll be uneven, Princess Keith. Okay, fine. Next, we're gonna add our little gems or rocks. Mm -hmm. So, I'm just gonna dump that in there. Ooh, that one's Ooh. a pretty blue. Well, I have a colorful blue in mine. I'm gonna put it in blue. And then I got this pretty clear one. Ta-da. Here we have our three different filters that we're testing. The first one over here, we have our towel along with kinetic sand gravel, and some gem rocks. Number two, we have paper towel, kinetic sand, gravel, and gem rocks. And the last one over here is our coffee filter, kinetic sand, gravel, and gem rocks. Which one do you guys think will filter out this gross dirt water the best? All right, with no further ado, I'm going to filter out my not so clean water, and it's gonna become really, really clean. Are you sure? Eh, clean enough. But I'm still not gonna drink it. All right, here we go. Is it coming out yet? Oh! I think I, it's taking time to go through. I think it's gonna take some time. Let's look at the bottom. Hmm. Nope, it's still running through. Um, nothing's happening yet, Princess Fam. Yeah, because my filter is a really good filter. I never said it was efficient. Oh, okay. How about we move on to the next one? I'm going to pour this in here. I'm gonna spread it around. I'm gonna spread my joy around. Ooh. Oh. You gotta put some dirt in there too. Oh, oh. yes. Okay, so let's 
go ahead and just do the last one over here. This is the coffee filter. So we're just gonna pour that in, add a little bit of dirt. There we go, and we wait. Hey, look, the water has made it to the bottom. Oh, and there it goes, and hey, it's actually looking pretty clear, but this might take a minute or two. Ooh, it's dripping out now. Check out this water. It's like a little bit, but it's still like drip, drip. <laughs> so we're gonna wait for it to filter through. Whoa, it's only been five years later, but my filter is finally dripping. And, and it's looking pretty good. Here we have all three of our filters with the water coming out. Can't wait to see the final result. Okay, we are back. It's been lots and lots of minutes later, mm -hmm. and I think our science experiment is done. So let's check it out. Here we have the towel, and then next to it, we have our paper towel, and then we have our coffee, coffee filter. Hmm. Let's take a look. So there's two ways to judge this experiment. First, you have to see which one is the clearest water, and then which one has the most. Hmm, okay, so our coffee filter definitely has the most, and it's not too bad. I think it's pretty clear. Mm -hmm. And then, hmm, actually this one over here looks the clearest, but yeah. there's barely, <laughs> barely any water. Because this towel right here, I think, is soaking in the water. Yep, super absorbent. Yep. And then we have this one here, which is our paper towel, and Eh. It has a good amount of water, yeah, but, but the water is not clear. Yeah, so I have to say, we had to choose between the mm. three. The winner is the coffee filter. This is the one we both guessed would be the clearest, and sure enough, it is. What do you guys think? Okay friends, that's the end of today's video. If you guys try this at home, make sure you let us know how it ends up. And if you like more science experiments, give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe. Bye, Prince and Princesses. Bye. Bye.